Hey guys, welcome back to Hendrickson Family Farm. I know it's been a while on making a video. I've been extremely busy and uh, haven't had a lot of time to make any videos. Um, we do have some things coming up. Um, we are going on vacation. Me and the girls, and, or Ava and Landon are going with me. Uh, Nina and Emma are going to stay home because they have a horse show they're, they're going to go to. Uh, can't really say a whole lot about it yet because we are going to be taking you guys with us while we go down and um, go on the vacation. We did get a new puppy. Uh, he is a purebred German Shepherd. He is a a sable um they call him a, a silver sable blue sable whatever you want to call him i'll turn the camera around so you can see him real quick gunny 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 he's after something right now gunny gunny so their ears don't so their ears don't always stand up right away. Uh, it does take a little time and then they can fall again is what uh, I've been told. We have got some new things on the farm uh, because we did lose power a couple times um, during the last month or so. So I went ahead and bought a brand new uh, welder generator. It's the Lincoln uh, Eagle and I bought this little trailer to put it on. It's just, uh, I think it's a homemade trailer. Um, and then I mounted this toolbox right here to the front of it. And I have like my welding leads down in here. Uh, I get some welding rod and then a bucket with some tools in it. And grinders and stuff. And then that's the other side. The, the electrode side. And have an extension cord in here. Um, we did have to also the air conditioner while we were on break so the the house the whole unit inside the house and outside the house got a new um air conditioner unit i don't that's the the brand that they they suggested it's absolutely crazy how much air conditioner units are nowadays um we had three people come out and give us quotes always get more than one quote when you're getting an air conditioner or any major work done to your house the first guy was the most expensive he was sixteen thousand dollars to do the uh air conditioner unit inside and outside in the on the house we called the next guy he was nine thousand to twelve thousand the third guy was like eight thousand was as high i don't remember what his low was um and then but then you have to start evaluating what what brands are they doing and it turned out they were all the same brand so the you were paying one guy for uh uh, I guess experience and then the other guys experience and the next guy's experience um, I don't really quite understand why you can have that big of a discrepancy in price but nonetheless they did um, so but I'm going to be putting a new plug in for the generator um, where they had to go in through the brick of the house right here I'm going to actually put a plug right above it, and this is where we're going to plug the generator in, where 
when we do um, have power outages. Uh, I just have to, I already have the cable and the plugs and stuff. I just got to get it done. Not a big deal. The biggest thing is finding time to do it all. Uh, we did uh, so we did have to take the one of the steers to the processors. Um, we will be getting it back in about um, I think next week. Um, and then the following week is whenever we leave for vacation, which I'm pretty excited about. I need a, I need a vacation. I need a little need a little me time. What are you doing, Ava? No, you can't hear it. Okay, Emma, you can turn on the blender. Even if you could, it wouldn't matter. Oh. Gunny, get out of there! So the new German Shepherd's name is Gunny. Gunny, what are you doing? He was over here in this mud puddle. So, we have had crazy amount of storms the last couple of weeks of here in Oklahoma uh, well I don't know about a couple weeks but we've had a bunch of storms and we've had quite a bit of rain but if you looked at the ground I mean there are some water puddles but not nothing like there should be uh, I am going to be mowing the yard today so I will uh, be setting up uh, the camera mowing and I would like to start working on the baler because I do have to take a link out of one of my chains. My timing keeps hopping on my, my square baler. Uh, and, and my square square baler is just a John Deere 224 uh, WS. The WS means wire tie. Um, so one of the, the chains here, it, uh, it, has, it, it has too much slack in it. Let me see better from this side has too much slack in it and the adjuster is all the way tight as it can so I'm gonna have to loosen it up and I'll pull a, a link out of it and uh, I need to get also need to get it kind of cleaned up because I am going to have to bail uh, the goat pen which there's no goats in it currently um, but I am gonna to have to get that done pretty quick. But with that being said, I believe I'm going to go ahead and start mowing. So I guess there's a chance of some thunderstorms again this afternoon uh, here. So we are going to try to get mowed everything that I can get mowed. Actually, you know what? Well, let's just talk about this zero turn mower that we bought it last year. I don't know if you guys remember or not, but it's a Red Max. Um, it's the 60 or 54 inch Red Max uh, zero turn mower. I'll pull it out here and then we can kind of look at it real fast. The RZT 54 inch zero turn Red Max mower. Um, so we've had it a year now and we have, let's see how many hours that we have on it. We have 71 hours on the mower. And zero turn mowers, and zero turn mowers, you're not necessarily supposed to pull a whole lot of stuff with them because it does have two separate hydraulic pumps to, to drive the mower or the, the motors for the drive tires. Well, with that being said, um, we do. We, we, we have used this thing as like a little lawn tractor since we've had it and it has done an awesome job the only thing i will say that i would it has the only con to this mower that i can think of is it doesn't have the blade speed that i think it needs i think the blades need to turn faster because sometimes if you get in a little bit taller yard, not necessarily like, not tall grass, because I don't like mowing tall grass, I got a tractor and brush hog for that. But sometimes if you get in your little taller grass, sometimes it doesn't cut really good. Even with brand new blades on and you sharpen them, uh, I just feel like the blade speed needs to be a little faster. 
Uh, now I'm not, I don't have anything to do with Red Max. They're just, it's just a mower that I, I bought um, and I like it. I just wish it had a little bit uh, higher blade, blade speed. But let's get mowing and um, we'll see how it goes. We got the yard mode, that looks pretty good. And now we have to hook up to the old horse trailer because we're gonna have to get ready to go take the horse to uh, the trainer. We're taking a Emery, which is uh, a pal little young Palomino that we have. Um, yeah, so we'll get it hooked up, get her loaded up, and then we'll get on down the road. 